All right, today I'm in Cherubs and I thought I'd teach you a song we learned last week. And this is all about learning to describe movement. So often in songs we just use noises, but today we're going to look at movement and we're going to look at movement of ocean animals. Now, some of you might have watched the video I put on, which was in tune with wheels on the bus that Charlene found, but we did our own version of that. Now, you can add more sea animals because there's no um, stingray in there and there's no lobster and you might know the name of some other animals that live in the sea that you want to add as well or you might want to make yourself a zoo version but it's all about describing how they move and it's to the tune of wheels on the bus so we'll start really simple now I'm having a look oh, easiest one that lives in the sea ah fish F -ish. fish now do you know what type of fish this is? I bet lots of you are shouting Nemo. And it is Nemo, and Nemo is a clownfish. So we start with fish, and we go, the fish in the ocean go. The fish in the ocean go. All day long. Now the next animal we're going to do is the crab. 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 The crab in the ocean goes pinch, 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 pinch. The crab in the ocean goes pinch, pinch, pinch all day long. Next animal is going to be the octopus oct op -us. octopus okay now he has eight arms it's a lot more than you and me so we're going to make our arms into our fingers so hide your thumbs so you've got eight the octopus in the ocean has eight wiggly arms eight wiggly arms eight wiggly arms the octopus in the ocean has eight wiggly arms all day long now our next one is the, do you know what it is? You can see the d d d d d sound. d o o f i n d o l f i n Okay, the p and the h make a f sound. Dolphin. Now you can either leap with your arm or you can leap with your body. I'm going to leap with my arm for this one, just so you can see me and not see my knees moving up and down. But you can leap with your body. The dolphin in the ocean goes leap, 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 leap. The dolphin in the ocean goes leap, 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 all day long. It's got this dolphin. Okay, now a new one for you it might be this one. If you've been at Cherubs last week, you'll know this one. He's got a huge, large horn on the end of his nose. And some of them have two horns. And the horns are made out of the same stuff as our fingernails. Okay? It's called keratin. And this animal is a n a r w a o n o w e l n o w e l Okay? And a narwhal is a really, really, look, my arms don't even fit on the screen, really, really big fish. With a huge long nose, okay, which is his pointy horn. And we're going to swim with our pointy horns, okay? So the narwhal in the ocean goes point, 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 point. The narwhal in the ocean goes point, 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 all day long. Now, we've got another one. Hmm. This one is a, what it is? J, E, O, O, Y, F, Ish, Jelly Fish. Now, he does a bit of wobbling and he also goes sting. But only his tentacles at the bottom sting. And he doesn't mean to. It's more if we swam or walked into him. Okay. So we're going to go, the jellyfish in the ocean goes wobble and sting, wobble and sting, wobble and sting. The jellyfish in the ocean goes wobble and sting all day long. 
Now I've got a, let's see what this one is. This is a t -t 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 turtle. He said tortoise, nearly right, but he walks on land, the tortoise with legs. If you look closely, you can see the turtle has flippers. One, two, three, four. And that's what makes him different to a tortoise. Tortoise has legs and lives on the land. Turtle has flippers. He can pull himself up onto the beach or herself, but mainly lives in the water. And it says t -uh -uh -t -l -b -b turtle. Okay, now he has a great big heavy shell on his back. So you're going to put your big heavy shell on and go swim. The turtle in the ocean does swim with his shell. Swim with his shell. Swim with his shell. The turtle in the ocean goes swimming with his shell all day long. Is it brilliant? Okay, I'm going to go for the... Sea lion. Okay, now this one does make a noise, but we're still remember focusing on the ocean action. So we've got s e a for sea, o i o n for lion. Okay, so we go. The sea lion in the ocean goes. The sea lion in the ocean goes. All day. Long. So did you make your big flippers? That's it. Bang them together. Alright, we have got... Oh, over here. They're all attached to the children's submarine. Seahorse. Okay. They're really tiny. If you can look these up on YouTube, they're amazing. Okay. And we've got... Seahorse, and it's always left to right, seahorse. And when they swim, they bob up and down. So we're going to do the seahorse in the ocean goes up and down, up and down, up and down. The seahorse in the ocean goes up and down all day long. Now we've got two more, two more. So there's a lot to learn. I'm going to push this iPad back because oh one of them involves jumping about a bit and it's this one although this one doesn't jump about itself it lies right at the bottom of the rock pools and it's called a do you know what it is it's to do with the shape starfish and a starfish is really clever these pointy bits are actually his legs can you count them with me one two three four, five. And if one breaks off, he can grow it back. How cool is that? Let's sound it out together. S -t -a -f -f -i -s. And her together makes shh. So it's star fish. Okay. So you ready? It goes. The starfish in the ocean has five points. Five points five points the starfish in the ocean has five points all day long you can count your points we've got one two three four five points okay now last one and even though this has got the littlest name this is the one we found hardest to remember this week now two S together make E. So we're E O E O. And he's an eel. One of the children knew that you can sometimes get electric eels. That's another good one to look up on YouTube to watch them. Okay, so are you ready? The eel in the ocean goes wiggle, 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 wiggle. The eel in the ocean goes wiggle, 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 all day long. So now you've learned lots and lots of describing movements for the ocean animals. So tomorrow when we do I spy to do with movements, so we do I spy using our eyes, we're going to have to remember all the things we've learned from the song. So you might want to sing the song first and then have a go at the I spy game. Okay, take care. See you soon.